Pelicans and Thunder NBA action here for Wednesday with New Orleans on the road. I'm showing OKC a three and a half point favorite, and this totals up to 227 and a half. Definitely seen a move to the over here in this one this morning with the Pelicans and the Thunder. I show this one opening as low as 225 and a half. So already a two point move. To the over this morning on this one. And uh, I think I've solved my problem. I'm one more day of having to reach all the way over here where I'm struggling with this setup. The camera didn't work. You know, but uh, I bought a mouse. So I'm going to be able to, I think, control things a little better. Hey, I've got a game. I've got a pick here on this one that I feel like is kind of a, a freemium for me. Here's Jose over, over, over. Well, Jose, you and I, uh, we're known to be uh, two of a kind, one of mind, if you will. And we're going over for sure uh, in this one tonight. Already stiff, stiff action uh, to the over here uh, from what I've seen. Um, I don't know. Let me check if it's, uh, I don't think it's been uh, steamy in here necessarily. I don't know if the Line, the line services did definitely report some moves to the over, but I don't think it was necessarily a, a huge chunk of money that came down. Yeah, there was some subtle double move here. And let me, I just want to take a look uh, at uh, Pelicans. Thank you for that, though. And Ernest says, Jeff, give me a, do me a favor. I need to check on the status of uh Brandon Ingram in this one, but uh, questionable with that knee injury coming in. So you definitely want his 22 and a half points per game in there at this uh, juncture. And I am giving it out as a free play here. I I am expecting him uh, to participate in the game. I don't know what uh, you guys, what your speculation might be. Here's the thunder for Ray. And I actually, um, I'm in a quandary on the side. I'm not sure even what I'm doing yet. Um, maybe keeping a little bit under wraps, but uh, maybe leaning more towards just trying to find something that in pocket here, this one. I've got the over. Uh, I'm giving you my best play in this game right now. Maybe it would qualify. I feel like it would qualify uh, for a premium, even with this move. Um tonight with the Pelicans and the Thunder. And I'll just, uh, maybe I could just leave it at that. You guys had some nice looks in there as well. But uh, I don't know, just the way I see it at this time, I mean, OKC, yeah, maybe I tried to get on them last time. Here's Darren says, give me the Thunder. They will cover. Ferner with a lean. And uh, I respect you guys with your leans. And I mean, I would just, if I was in a chat though, with uh, you and I, uh, hey Kev, nice to see you. I saw you last night. Uh, saw you in one, some chat room over there, some uh, uh, live sweat room or something like that. <laughs> me and Kev, you know, me and Kev hanging out in uh, live sweat rooms. Hey, you know, we're we're men, so you know we're 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 beyond that. We can handle it in the live sweat room together. Nice to see you, brother. And uh, here we have Oklahoma City three and one with three and one spread record so far. New Orleans two and one, two and one spread record. Both these teams, um, not bad start certainly here to get going. And I'm gonna end up um, in this one on the under, uh, on the over, over. Let's make it clear, I'm on the over in this game. Like I said, a strong play for me here no no distinctive moves here or no distinctive patterns yet with these two teams that would indicate you got new orleans actually one and two to the under so far kev will go over with me okay that's good enough final and uh, here comes some of that chinese basketball coming in here uh, Guangdong loses Tian to Tianjin. Is that? Do I need to give out the scores to you guys? Are you guys waiting on results and uh, sweating games or something? 
the, welcome to those of you who just watch Guangdong over Tianjin. And the thing about, I will say about Chinese, the, and oh, here it is. Okay. Oh, Beijing did beat Guangzhou. Okay. Beijing wins 117 to 104. And, but the thing about the, uh, the CB is it's on that FanDuel TV, right? So it actually gets very pretty, pretty good coverage. Pretty good coverage, I'd say. Uh, you can get all uh, all those games pretty much if you're up in the middle of the morning and you want to early in the morning. 